Brought to you by wikivd.com Fentanyl Fentanyl is a potent, synthetic opioid pain medication with a rapid onset and short duration of action. It is a potent agonist of mu opioid receptors in the brain. Fentanyl is 50 to 100 times more potent than morphine, but some fentanyl analogs, which are designed to mimic the pharmacological effects of the original drug, may be as much as 10,000 times more potent than morphine. It is on the World Health Organization's list of essential medicines, the most effective and safe medicines needed in a health system. Fentanyl was first made by Paul Janssen in 1960. Following the medical inception of pethidine several years earlier, Janssen developed fentanyl by assaying analogues of the structurally related drug pethidine for opioid activity. The widespread use of fentanyl triggered the production of fentanyl citrate, which entered medical use as a general anesthetic under the trade name sublimase in the 1960s. Following this, many other fentanyl analogues were developed and introduced into medical practice, including serentanil, alfentanil, remafentanil, and lofentanil, in the mid-1990s. Fentanyl was introduced for palliative use with the fentanyl patch, followed in the next decade by the introduction of the fentanyl lollipop, dissolving tablets, and sublingual spray which are absorbed through the tissues inside the mouth. Fentanyl was the most widely used synthetic opioid in medicine. In 2013, 1,700 kg were used globally. Fentanyl is also used as a recreational drug, leading to thousands of overdose deaths from 2000 to 2017. Deaths have also resulted from improper medical use. Fentanyl has a relatively wide therapeutic index which makes it a very safe surgical anesthetic when monitored carefully. However, its potency requires careful measurements of highly diluted fentanyl in solution. Intravenous and intrathecal Intravenous fentanyl is often used for anesthesia and analgesia. During anesthesia it is often used along with a hypnotic agent like propofol. It is also administered in combination with a benzodiazepine, such as midazolam to produce sedation for procedures such as endoscopy, cardiac catheterization, and oral surgery, or in emergency rooms. It is often used in the management of chronic pain including cancer pain. Fentanyl is sometimes given intrathecally as part of spinal anesthesia or epidurally for epidural anesthesia and analgesia. Because of phenotyl's high lipid solubility, its effects are more localized than morphine, and some clinicians prefer to use morphine to get a wider spread of analgesia. Patches Fentanyl transdermal patches are used in chronic pain management. The patches work by slowly releasing fentanyl through the skin into the bloodstream over 48 to 72 hours, allowing for long-lasting pain management. Dosage is based on the size of the patch, since, in general, the transdermal absorption rate is constant at a constant skin temperature. Rate of absorption is dependent on a number of factors. Body temperature, skin type, amount of body fat, and placement of the patch can have major effects. The different delivery systems used by different makers will also affect individual rates of absorption under normal circumstances. The patch will reach its full effect within 12 to 24 hours, thus fentanyl patches are often prescribed with a fast-acting opiate to handle breakthrough pain. It is unclear if fentanyl gives pain relief to people with neuropathic pain. In palliative care, transdermal fentanyl has a definite, but limited, role for care must be taken to guard against the application of external heat sources which in certain circumstances can trigger the release of too much medication and cause life-threatening complications. Duragesic was first approved by the College Terbi Ordeling van Genese Middelin, the Medicines Evaluation Board in the Netherlands, on July 17, 1995, as 2550, 75 
and 100 micrograms per hour formulations after a set of successful clinical trials, and on October 27, 2004, the 12 micrograms per hour formulation was approved as well. On January 28, 2005, the U.S. Food and Drug Administration approved first-time generic formulations of 25, 50, 75, and 100 micrograms per hour fentanyl transdermal systems through an FTC consent agreement derailing the possibility of a monopoly in the treatment of breakthrough chronic pain by Alzacorp. In some cases, physicians instruct patients to apply more than one patch at a time, giving a much wider range of possible dosages. For example, a patient may be prescribed a 37.5 micrograms dosage by applying one 12.5 micrograms patch and one 25 micrograms patch simultaneously, or contingent on the large size of the 100 micrograms per hour patch. Multiple patches are commonly prescribed for doses exceeding 100 micrograms per hour, such as two 75 micrograms per hour patches worn to afford a 150 micrograms per hour dosage regimen. Although the commonly referred to dosage rates of December 25, 50, 75 one hundredths of a microgram per hour, the 12 micrograms patch actually releases 12.5 micrograms per hour. It is designed to release half the dose of the 25 micrograms per hour dose patch. Duragesic is manufactured by ALZA Corporation and marketed by Janssen Pharmaceutica. During the period of June 2002 through June 2003, Duragesic sales totaled more than $1 billion. As of July 2009, construction of the Duragesic patch had been changed from the gel pouch and membrane design to a drug in adhesive matrix design formulation, as described in the prescribing information. This construction makes illicit use of the fentanyl more difficult. Sublingual Abstral dissolves quickly and is absorbed through the sublingual mucosa. To provide rapid analgesia, fentanyl is a highly lipophilic compound, which is well absorbed sublingually and generally well tolerated. Such forms are particularly useful for breakthrough cancer pain episodes, which are often rapid in onset, short in duration and severe in intensity. Thank you for watching. Brought to you by wikivd.com. Please like and subscribe below. Please like and subscribe below.